Hi guys, how are you today? This is Daniel recording from Los Angeles again. And uh, today we would like to show you guys how do I repair the IC chip issue of our an outdoor LED module. The example I'm taking here right now is the P12 from Sensitech from China. This is a very typical module because the IC chip is not on the back side of the PCB and it is located in the same side as the LED diodes. So it means in the manufacturer they put the IC chip on the same on the same side as the as the IC chip. So we remove the shaders and we we notice that there's a, a red IC chip zone is off. So we can assume that there's a bad red bad IC chip which controls the red zone in this area. Uh, we are going to replace it. Firstly, we have to scratch off the silicon the black silicon glue between the pixels and on the and which covers the IC chip. It's not an easy job, it has to be done little by little because we are not we are not supposed to to hurt the IC chip or the PCB board. So we do it very carefully and uh, patiently. The space between pixels are limited, but it's good enough for us to. After we think all the black silicon glue is removed, about uh, which covers the IC chip, we are able to use the hot air nozzle to remove the IC chip. After removing the acid chip, we can see easily there is uh, some black glue layer beneath the acid chip. This is the root. Who caused this soldering? This this bad soldering because during the manufacturing, the silicon glue was in liquid mode, so. It goes in beneath the acid chip and becomes solid. After using for a time, for like one year or a couple months, then become they become bigger due to the heat. So makes the acid chip with bad connections between the pinks. So some people try to repair repair just the resoldering the IC chip pins but apparently this won't work for long for long long so if you really want to solve this problem you have to take out clean the PCB board beneath the IC chip make sure it's super clean and then you can put a new IC chip We use some flux to help the soldering to the pins. We line up and then we, s we put a little bit of solder to make sure the IC chip is not going to move and then we're going to solder side by side little by little too. Since the space is not that big, as we can notice, the time on the monitor it costs about ten to twelve minutes to do this process. After 
the IC chip is fixed on the PCB board, this is not going to be the end of the process. You also can't forget to put some black silicon glue back to make sure this is waterproof. Also, put the shader back and the screws back. Right now, we're going to do a, te a final test to make sure the S chip is fixed per totally. Also, we are going to do some very strong impact test to make sure to find the potential S chip issue, and then that's the end. Now, this is the tool so I'm using right now. Taco soldering station as well as the uh, Veller hot air station. Make sure the heat when you use it, the heat won't hurt the pixels around it. If you are looking for someone to help you to repair your outdoor LED modules, feel free to give me a phone call today. I can be reached at 323-687-3550 Again, 323-687-3550 I'm Daniel from Los Angeles So, please don't forget to subscribe my channel on YouTube if you think it's really helpful for you or share with your friends if necessary Thank you, bye bye See you next time.